Hi, I'm Rebecca from Little Adventure Shop and in this video I'm going to review the two largest Deuter kids sleeping bags, the Deuter Starlight and the Deuter Starlight Pro. Okay, so the Deuter Starlight, which is the blue one in front here, and the Starlight Pro behind in the orange, are fundamentally the same bags. The only difference is that the Pro has more insulation in it. So I'll get on with that later, but I'm just gonna talk you through all the features that they have in common at the moment. So this is the Starlight in front, and the height from here to here is 160. And then they both have an extendable piece at the bottom. I just unzip here. So effectively the bag grows with your child and you get an extra 30 centimeters of length at the bottom. I just show you the base here, it's got two handy hooks for if you need to air it out or wash it. And then if we look at the zip, it has both bags have one zip down the side, a um, little bit of Velcro there. The zip comes all the way down to here when you open it up. The fabric on the inside is slightly different to the outside, it's a bit more soft, has a slightly more cottony feel to it, although it is fully synthetic, so it's easy to care for and easy to clean. Um, it's also got, I'm not sure if you can see that, but there's a little pocket hidden in there as well, so you can put any valuables you want to keep close by during the night. I just zip that up again. Now the shape of the bag is, it's a mummy. You can't really see it on the hanger. So if I just take it off and you'll see, you've got a hood shape that comes around here. So it's a really cozy bag if you zip it right up. And if it's really cold, you can even just cinch it in a bit with this draw cord on the top here to stop any drafts coming in. On the inside here, there's a baffle. So again, to help prevent drafts coming in through the zip. That's a little baffle that overlays the full length of the zip. Oops, got that zipped up. So yeah, lovely sleeping bag. The height of the ch child that Deuter recommend for this is from 130 to 170 in length. Um, so it's got a single layer of insulation throughout. So it's a really good quality insulation. Um, but it, what it means is probably good for kind of late spring through to early autumn for in terms of warmth. Now, the next one I was going to tell you about is the uh, Starlight Pro, which is the orange bag here. So it's identical. I've got it fully extended here, as you can see. Everything we've just talked about is exactly the same. The only difference is it's got basically twice as much insulation. So you probably can't really see from this angle, but um, this bag is much more suitable if you want to go camping in, say, Easter or right through to October half term. You're a bit more worried about the cold um, and your children staying warm, then it might be worth investing in this bag. The best way to show you the difference in insulation is if I use these stuff sacks here. So this is the Pro. This is what it, it, this bag um, squidges down to. And this is this bag, but in a different color. This is the uh, Starlight on its own. So Starlight Pro, Starlight, and you can see the difference in uh, the amount of insulation you've got in there. So I hope this helps you decide about which bag you want to, to get hold of. Um, there is one other bag in the range that unfortunately I haven't got here, but that is called the Deuter Starlight Square. And it's basically this bag, the Starlight, except the bottom half of the bag is square. So it's, it's shoulder width here all the way down. And then the zip on that bag comes all the way down the side and around the bottom. So you can open it out into a big, um, blanket if you want to. So there we go, Deuter Starlight Pro, Deuter Starlight. Hope that's helped make it clear what the differences are. Um, if you, I've missed anything, please pop it in the comment section below. And um, if you enjoyed the video, please like it and subscribe to our channel if you want to see similar content. Many thanks.